I, got, I can't say enough about the band, the Goo Goo Dolls. We love them on Mix 94.1, hit after hit after hit, and the latest is still alive off of their new album, Boxes. Johnny Resnick is in studio. Woo! How are you? How are you? How do you keep doing it? I mean, just, I, don't know. The, I love this song. I thank cannot you. get enough of it. It's like on repeat right oh, thank now. Thank you very much. The new album is called Boxes. Yep. And I downloaded it a couple weeks ago. Okay. And I'm going to, uh, if you don't mind, I'm going to take over as your manager now. I would. Oh. Okay, so, so I, I don't want okay. to. You're out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Here's why, okay? Here's the single we're playing, So Alive. This one right here. Awesome. Beautiful. Okay. Hit. Right? Yes, Hit. absolutely. Okay. okay, this thing is taking off, okay? Once yeah. this is, I was like, this song's amazing, this is awesome. We're going to go to track number 11, which is Long Way Home. Okay. That's going to be the next single. I love that song. Okay. <laughs> JC's picking your next this single. This is a okay, release because <laughs> the next single. Listen to it. It's a long way home. It's a long way home. This is good. I like, I like humanity. You like this? This is good. Okay. So people were like, my gosh, they Google it all. This is amazing. This is like a, this is even an anthem, I think, this song. Yeah, the I can see it. The coming home or like a, I don't know American Idol's off era, but something like that where the contestants are going home for the first time. Okay, and then what do you uh, have? I just missed it by like a year. <laughs> I know, yeah, darn it, that's why I gotta be your manager. Okay, so America's gonna be like, this is unbelievable, what's next? We're gonna release track number one over and over. The best part of this, about this song is where the, the crazy synthesizer comes up. Yeah, yeah. this part coming up right here is okay, my favorite part. I think you're onto something. You want to hire him, Tony? I, I like that. <laughs> well, that's how we'll do it. And, and, and just people are like, loving the Google Dolls. I've mapped out the singles for you Thank guys. You very much. Yeah, you got it. Huh? Nice. What, what was the, uh, the whole inspiration behind this? What, what is Boxes? What, where did you come up with this? Give us um, some details. Well, okay. Um, well, we sort of wrote a song called Boxes. Yeah. And, and then, then what's just that decided about? the album would be called that. <laughs> it, it's just but, all encompassing. It's like a big box of our songs or uh, what? <laughs> no, uh, it was kind of, there's a song in the album called Boxes and, and in that Boxes it's, it's basically a song about, um, you know, it's nice to remember your past. You shouldn't forget your past, but you can't live in it. You can't dwell in it. You know what I mean? I like that. So it's like you put your memories in these little boxes and you can go and open them up and visit them. But just live your life. It's, so it's like a it's it's not a literal box, which I do have a literal box of memories yeah. that I sometimes go. But it's also the the figurative box. That just, oh, oh, think yeah. about that and go the, back to the it. Metaphorical box. Do you have one of these X boxes? And I'm talking about the video game system. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 this is, um, you know, it, it's like a box of like you know, a past lover or something. No. And you just keep mementos and stuff. No. I I have no. an X box, and it's like love notes from from my first true love, like when I was 19 love notes, pictures, and it's in my house. And I'm so afraid that my wife is gonna find this someday. Oh. Well, you know, you're telling her right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, she doesn't listen to our show. First of all, <laughs> you're at work. Good point. She's she, like, where is it? She's gonna, she's gonna, listen, if your wife wanted to find it, she would. It is a good point. In your, in your box of memories, though. I don't have one. Well, okay, in your, in your mind of memories, like what's, what are your best memories of, of one of your more famous songs? Like. What do you think is your most well-known song with oh, the Google Dolls? Wow, you know, Iris. Course, Iris. But, and yeah. Do you have a good memory associated with that one? Uh, I have a million good memories associated with that song because it, it just it completely changed our lives. It yeah. was really, really amazing to, to be on top of something for that long. You know, it was, like, it, was, it was exciting and it opened our lives. I don't know if we particularly handled it all that well but really? but yeah you know i mean we went out and went crazy for a year or two you know it was number one but, for like 18 weeks in a row yeah, wasn't it it was pretty insane i i heard that you whenever you sing it you think about nicholas's nicholas cage's character yes and, and did you ever meet him he lives no. here in las vegas now did you know that does he really yeah, yeah. wow well no no i never met i i uh i sat behind him at the premiere of that movie and you know i was looking at the back of his head the whole time. Sort of <laughs> assessing things. The movie is City of Angels, and I think of lumber trucks. Oh, yeah. The scene. But it really has stood the test of time. There's some songs they don't, and every time I hear that, I just, I, I get the feels. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm just oh, like, thank you oh, my goodness. I, appreciate it. I noticed on Twitter you follow two people. I don't follow anybody. Someone does that for me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who are the two 
people that I'm curious now. Take a guess. He follows two people. A uh, Giada De Laurentiis. Oh, no, no. I should look at her. Yeah, she's on TV right now. Oh my god. I would get in so much trouble if I followed her. Robbie. Robbie, yes? Yeah. And. The Goo Goo Dolls. Oh, the Goo Goo Dolls. <laughs> really? That's now, it. not to start any controversy. Wait, really? <laughs> yeah, you follow Robbie and you follow your band. All right. No, well, I don't want to start any controversy here. Okay. But I was doing some research on Robbie. Yeah. He doesn't follow you back. Oh, whatever. Uh huh. He whatever. Because he knows I have nothing to say. Unfollow him right now. <laughs> Let's get on your Twitter. You're right. I'm going to call someone and say, uh, unfollow. Him. Just unfollow the guy. He's just not worth it. Well, we wanted to see if we could play a game with you. We have Johnny. Yes, I agree. Yes. We have Johnny Resnick from Goo Goo Dolls in studio. The new album is called Boxes. It's 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 Goo Goo Dolls. It's like it's it's vintage Goo Goo Dolls. I, I, love, it. I love I love 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 it. I love the singles that you have selected mm -hmm. too. Mm -hmm. Okay, what's the game that we're playing? It's called Jam It with Johnny. Jam It with Johnny. Jam It with Johnny. Okay. okay. And, and Johnny has his guitarist TK here. And, uh, mm -hmm. and is, is, BK. Cool? My what? BK. BK. <laughs> BK is gonna play guitar. Okay. Because I don't know any songs. Okay. Well, we have the own. we You're call the Culture of Doom. Okay. It's Mercedes against me. It's you and I against each other. Okay. You're gonna reach into the cold right, room. Here I go. And you're gonna find there's gonna be a band. There's some okay. curveballs in there. You're gonna open it up and you guys are gonna perform that song and Mercedes is gonna have to try to guess and I'll have to try to guess. Oh my god. Yeah. Take it away, BK. Yeah. Woo! I live my life like there's no tomorrow. studio in Los Angeles and I was sitting outside smoking a cigarette and and uh, he, he walked up to me and he said hey Goo Goo can I bump a smoke off you and I was like sure and I gave him a cigarette and he took the cigarette and he I gave him my lighter and he lit it and I said how's it going and he like took a really long drag and held it in very dramatic lets it out and goes extraordinary <laughs> we should all be so extraordinary. I know. But, uh, <laughs> Diamond Dave. Okay, one nothing. Okay, I'm winning. Okay. Uh, Jamming with Johnny. Jamming with Johnny. Okay, here we go. Okay. Yeah, take it, BK. <laughs> See the guitar for a second. I used to do this thing where I would make up a Bruce Springsteen song, like I was able to. I'm gonna try it because I don't know. Oh my gosh! Okay. Kathy got up in the morning and she looked in the mirror and said, "I can't take this life anymore. I need somewhere to go." So she packed her bags and ran away to a place that she called home, but nobody calls anymore. You gotta do that more. <laughs> sort of, he does that thing. Can I wake up and see that you're here next to me? <laughs> <laughs> 
feel like that. Oh, you're my gosh, if my eyes were closed, I would think maybe it was Bruce Springsteen. That's well, crazy. maybe his drunk cousin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cousin Stanley, Eddie Springsteen. Stanley Springsteen. All right, we know you're, you, you, Johnny has things to do. We'll do one more and we'll wrap things this up. This will here. be the tiebreaker between you and I since we both got yeah, one, yeah. okay? Which, which uh, area is more comfortable? You don't like it, go back I in. I haven't done my Springsteen in a while, so Man, that's, really so that's far. good. But, you know, you just, you just make that. We just made it up. You need to be on Jimmy Fallon and go head to head with the impressions. Like, Jamming no. with Johnny. Oh. Listen, you know, I'm, I've laid out your singles. I'm going to book you on Fallon. We're going to do Jamming with Johnny. Yeah, you, good luck. You know what? We're good, sending good this luck. to Jimmy we'll today. And we're going to make this oh, happen. Okay. We're done. He's amazing, though. I mean, it's it's freakishly good when he does that. Yeah, it's like, pretty it's good. Like, it's like, like his Neil Young is so much better than Neil Young. Yeah, yeah, he's spot on. Yeah, because like, he, he was dressed up and Neil Young came out and they're like next to each other and you couldn't tell who was who. Do you have any celebrity impressions in your pocket? Yeah, do you? Me? Um, yeah, come on. Um, I can do the perverted grandfather on uh, Family Guy. Do that, do that. <clears throat> oh, this is good. Hey, Johnish. Nice. You know what I'm talking about? The old pervert guy who likes the boys? I think it's mine, Johnny. See if you know who I am, okay? Okay, I want to. Oh, Shakira. <laughs> <laughs> okay, last one. You can make it on a wish if you want to. You can make it on a wish if you want to. Who's, now, who's that? Spencey! That's you! <laughs>